Hello class, today we'll be talking about bias. Remember, everything is bias. Except for this one source that I like, or me. And the most biased thing in the world is Wikipedia, so never trust Wikipedia. That thing is filled with information and fuck lies and false news and anybody can go Ah, the hypocrisy of the world. I think we all had that time where the teacher's lecture is all about bias, then forfeits the entire thing when the entire thing turns around to herself. It's like if two countries were in dispute, and that one country brings some information and says this is true because I have this information, have facts, how would other country looks at it and says that's completely false because it's from you. That is bias! Uh, except for that's exactly what the whole world is happening right now. But you get my point. Bias acknowledged by practically almost every educated person around the world. Yet all of them gets all defenses and claims that them themselves can never ever be biased. Thus, I believe that the root of all evil is bias, aside from greed and social media. Think about it, why is it that people hate each other all around the world, and that civilians would join the army to fight in wars when they, all they want to do is just go home and sleep? Is it because we're patriotic, or is it because we kind of believe that the other person actually meant harm to us, when they most likely aren't, as they are civilians just like us, just want to go home and have a nice sleep. So why are we hating each other? Why do we think they would cause harm? It's because they think differently than us. Because of their situation, because of the surrounding, they have their own biases and we have ours. And we would not trust their bias and they won't trust ours, and that brings this miscommunication. And because of that, they would say something, maybe even bring facts to it, and we would disagree. And we say the same thing, they disagree. And eventually that disagreement gets bigger and bigger, larger and larger, enhanced by propaganda, enhanced by government-controlled media, until eventually we go to a breaking point of fully hating one another. That is not good. If we get rid of bias, we just start and think that perhaps they may have a point, or perhaps if we just stopped fighting, we could have just worked with each other and fix all our issues. But then again, that's like asking someone who's standing in the rain to not get wet. But wait, I can still try. But how do we fix this? First up, remember, everybody is biased. Everybody. Yes, even you, even me, even this video. So take everything with a grain of salt. It's part of human nature to be biased. We want to feel like we are right. We want to feel like we are part of a crowd of people that believe what they're right. And if someone comes in that has some different opinion than ours, it's our natural instinct to disagree with it. However, we should try. Try to. Just remember that while we disagree with them because we think we are right, they think the same about us. And if we all just stop and remember the fact that we are all biased, perhaps they are not 100% wrong, perhaps we are not 100% right, we can start having a formal debate, a very key tool in a society. And with that, we can maybe start unraveling what was the truth behind everything. And so we can open our eyes into what they see and they can see what we see. And we can come in, conform and believe in one thing together. Or perhaps they split and believe in multiple things, but at the end of the day, we notice now they are a human being, they're not just some entity, an enemy that we are seeing across the world. No, they are humans just like us. They have feelings, they have emotions. If we respect that, they will also respect us. And with that, the world will be a lot more safer, a lot more peaceful, and a lot less conflicted. The golden rule still applies. You still need to treat people the way that you want to be treated. You can even hate someone. You can hate and abhor their actions. They're doing, they're doing terrible things and they need to be hated. But you still need to treat them with respect.